Hello, let's look at the new Easy Search and Worksoft Certify. So, in my project here, I have my sandbox for my working projects, and then I have my functional tests. So, I know I was working on my bike paint project last week, but I don't remember exactly where I put it. So, if I just type bike paint, what I can see here in the Easy Search window is that I have processes and results that contain the word bike paint. So, it looks like I had a couple of these, version 50 and 51. What I'm really interested in is the one on my process. I could limit this by process, or I can keep all of them. If I do a right click, say show in finder, I'll get navigated directly to my process and I can double click it and start editing it. So one of the big things that you want to encourage is reusability when you're editing your processes. So for example, I want to reuse an SAP login module. So my easy search here is actually linked to my certify main window. I can actually link it over here or I can unpin it and let it float over here on the right. It's up to me. But what I need to do is I need to go find a login. So if I create login, I can see all processes results that have login inside of it, even variables and results. But if I say just show me the processes, what I can see here is I have different logins. Um, the tooltip shows me this process will use to log into my SAP system. This one does different logins and validations. But it looks like this is the one I want. So I'm just going to drag and drop that into my process. So now what I've done is very quickly identified my usable component by searching for it, drag and dropped it into my process. So it's pretty easy. That's the concept behind easy search. Now if we start looking at the process themselves, we'll notice there's different things I can search. I can search processes, layouts, variables, results. I can even go to advanced and look for different attributes. But I think in the day-to-day -day life, if I want to variableize this, I can see when I gathered this through capture, there's a sole two party and a ship two party. Well, if there's a two party, I definitely want to go. So there's a sole two party and a ship two party variables already existed. So I'm going to select sole two and I'm going to drag and drop the variable in. I'm going to click ship to drag and drop the variable in. So what I'm showing you is how easy it is to edit your processes with WorkSoft and we've added easy search to let you do drag and drops from a search window versus drag and drops from other windows. So what we feel is this will make it much much easier to actually edit your processes, encourage reusability, but then also find things that you may not know about. So um, say VA01. I know there's lots of sales orders out there, but I actually don't know how much data has been created for different sales orders. I can actually search that. I can see my processes, my variables, and even my results. So the idea is I have full text search of anything I want. I can see what processes included via ones, what results had them, what variables, what layouts. So it just makes it really easy for to find anything. And if I'm interested in something, I can double click it and we'll actually launch that into the editor for you. Um, or I can actually do like I did before, a right click and say show in finder. So hopefully this will help you really accelerate your editing and maintenance of your certified processes.